most of the community think that playing solo is way too hard and refuse to do it. But I'm going to show you how I take over Foswipe pass a solo online raiding groups, controlling my area, and taking every fight. This was all recorded in an official server as soon as Foswipe started. Thank you guys for watching and enjoy the video. All right, all right. Another day at the office. <laughs> Let's see how it goes. Bow guy not killing first spawn in first wipe. <laughs> this is going to be a good day. This, I know I say it every time, but I love to see everyone running around naked rock. It feels like if Rust is a fair game, just <laughs> just for a few minutes, yeah. Oh, no way, this is huge. Oh my god, if he killed me there. Dude, server wiped like 5 minutes ago. This guy probably died to a bird or something like that. It happens a lot since they change animals in Rust. By the way, I think we are actually going to build around here. There is a large oil fishing village, metro, and outpost and bandit to recycle. Alright, this is perfect spot for my base. Oh, the heck? I heard someone behind me, for sure. I'm pretty sure I heard someone jumping. Oh my god, if I missed the headshot, I was probably dead. The Jackie is so fucking deadly, dude. Actually crazy that this guy opened just one tool crate and found one. What the heck? I'm gonna finish my base fast. The next 30 minutes basically consisted on stacking green cards and comps in my swamp, doing a little recycling run, trading some stone for wood, and then I crafted a war mage level 1 and headed to harbor to get a blue card. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> why? Come on. What, what do you mean, why? Uh, not worth it. Not worth the arrows. It's not worth the arrows, my boy. <laughs> my boy, okay, dude. That's 20 stone a shot. I don't have, even have any stone. Alright, you ask for it. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> I'm not a spooky. Come on. <laughs> hey, <mother> <laughs> <laughs> Why is everyone talking so much, dude? Oh, Orifan is working. I'm gonna try to loot it carefully because this is a really good spot for a group. So I'm expecting a few guys around here. Nice. Oh yeah, I hear a few of them around. I'm just gonna try to sneak into the puzzle and get out of here. Oh, by the way, little tip. If you recycle from here, people can't push you. Or it never happened to me at least. Right, home sweet home. I should be replacing this wooden door soon though. Nice. I'm gonna do a few base upgrades and we'll go outside. With my base sorted, I headed to the fishing village to buy a boat. Okay. Meh. 
Well, loot is loot, I guess. <laughs> Alright, let's go. I said it many times, Deus Ex is really OP. So what I did was spend in the next hour farming a scrap around there. I have to say I had a few unfortunate encounters. <laughs> no, oh my God, let me but out. overall, I made a lot of progress. So, after doing a big recycling run and trading some green cards for a scrap, I crafted a War Match level 2 and I was actually close to getting a War Match level 3 as well. And as I wanted to start trading and take 3 MP5 as soon as possible, I went to the metro to keep grinding more scrap. The boys are here. Oh, I think he's solo actually. Oh my god, he's taking so much damage. He's gonna be one HP, dude. <laughs> yeah, he was one HP. That's it. Yeah, nice. <laughs> he started farming. Well, not, not like I work it a lot for that kill, honestly. <laughs> I guess I will have to farm myself. This is the risky part. Because this is Opus the elevator and there's always people camping it on wipe day, dude. And I only have two nails on my nail gun. But I have to take the risk. What the heck is this guy doing? The heck there's one more coming. <laughs> this is what I meant about Opus Elevator. But well at least they only have bows. Okay, we are fine dude. The gang's here. <laughs> Imagine if they were the ones camping the elevator instead. Nice dude. Let's get out of here. Alright, I still need to do another recycling run, but first I'm gonna farm up some wood to keep furnaces going. Dude, I, I hate farming wood, but hey, having a chainsaw helps a lot. Nice, took his sulfur as well. Did I stack him so much? I wanna race everyone around. <laughs> nice, nice man. Day one is going really good. We are stacking a lot of comps, a lot of metal and sulfur. And I'm gonna be crafting a warbridge level 3 ASAP. Oh what the heck? <laughs> oh my god. It's the same guy dude. He's so mad. This is Rusty in a nutshell, like I've been trying to get a weapon all day long and now that I'm about to take 3 MP5, now I get a revolver. <laughs> but well, it doesn't really matter honestly. After that, I did a little recycling run, traded a few more green cards and that was finally enough to craft myself a Warrange level 3. I take 3 MP5, which is my favorite and probably the best weapon in the game as well, and with MP5 acquired, it was time to start getting seriously loaded. Oh, okay, we are going for that. Holy shit, I thought he was one shot. Another revolver to the collection. There's going to be a lot of people running only with Rebos today. Oh, that's a big revolver. <laughs> ah, this, I really need to get a hollow sight ASAP. I think I killed this guy. I don't know where his teammate, but I need these meds. <laughs> I 
<sighs> this guy is hiding and baiting his teammate so hard, dude. I don't know what is this guy doing, he's just hiding around, he, he might be just uh, loaded or something like that So I'm just gonna loot the python and go Oh, I don't think he saw me Oh my god, holy shit, that's so much. Why can't people just depot? <laughs> Fuck it, I'm panicking. I don't want to get shot while looting. I didn't mean to drop that. Oh, oh, oh I'm being greedy. This is huge. Oh, come on. I'm gonna bleed out because I drop all my healings, dude. That's so unfortunate. I'm gonna try to hide my body. I should have kept just one bandage, but I was uh, panicking when looting the guy. Ah, but I don't think he knows that I'm here because I don't hear him around. Yes, no way. Get me out of here, please. Let's go, man. Holy. <laughs> if I lost all that to a Rebo guy, I would have been so disappointed. Holy, we are taking so much sulfur, dude. We're gonna be doing a lot of raids this vibe. Look at this. It's so much, dude. And day one didn't even finish yet. So I'm gonna be trying to get a compound and a few large furnaces running soon. Well, and as I was stacking a lot of stone as well, I decided to do some base upgrades. With my base sorted, I still needed a lot of scrap to take three large furnaces and stuff to make a compound. So I went to the metro. I need to research flashlight, dude. I couldn't see anything. Oh, but I can hear someone running. Yeah, yeah, one of them jump out for sure. And I guess there is still another one in the train. I think I killed the guy with the worst loot of the group. <laughs> ah, this guy could be hiding with the bee anywhere. And I'm stupid enough to try to find him. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Holy shit. Why do I even like this game? <laughs> so much suffer all the time. Me well, well, I was trying to find a bet, honestly. He has some some seats, yeah. <laughs> okay, not bad. Actually, I'm gonna buy another refinery. It's so much more worth it buying it in the opus than crafting one. What <laughs> the heck is that guy doing? Nice, nice, he should be dead. Oh my god, not again. Holy. But I'm scared that I'm going to get shot in the back while looting. Okay, let's go, let's go. Actually, I'm so greedy, but I want the jacket, dude. All 
right price. Wife is going so good because I'm grinding a scrap only, but every time I go out, I find someone farming hardcore. I'm being so lucky with that, honestly. Oh, semi shots in my domains. We are going for that. Nice, I'm gonna need a shit ton of wood to make a compound now. <laughs> Holy shit, dude, I almost got a compound bow headshot. There are so many drops around here. Another one. <laughs> Shooting MP5 so early into the wipe just brings so much attention. What the heck, dude? Oh my god, and I'm actually going to die now. <laughs> Holy shit. This forest is like the perfect place for the groups, man. I'm gonna dip and come back. There's so many people around my area, dude. It's so fun to play, honestly. I guess it is because uh, the opposite is really close, and a lot of people like to build around it. Oh, and that's the flashlight that I wanted to research. Nice. I'm gonna go there just uh, broken shards since I'm just fighting rivals anyways. Did I ever mention that I hate Sar? I don't even know what I'm going to do with all these revolvers. Alright, nice. I'm gonna take the Jackie and farm up a little bit of stone. I want to make a compound already and start smelting the sulfur. Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. But I have to do it. There are way too many grubs in my area already. I'm sorry guys, but they, he just built in front of my base, like what was he expecting anyways? Oh no, no, <laughs> I just don't want to watch this. <laughs> but this is rust, okay? Like, it's not my fault. <laughs> It was never about the loot, it was about sending a message. <laughs> I, I gotta stop messing around and farm up the stone finally, dude. <laughs> oh. Nice. I know I said that we have to farm up a stone, but in my defense, I have to say that we find someone who already did it for us, then we don't have to do it. What an amazing logic by Gorliak. <laughs> well, this is not the guy that I was trying to find. Oh, we found the guy. Hey, nice. Let's go back. With the stone acquired, it was finally time to make a compound.
so many people with revolvers, dude. It's actually scary. I can't see his rib, though. It's actually so hard to find any pistol in this game. Like, not only revolvers, but uh, like any pistol. Actually, you know what? This is still only like 24 hours into Fosswipe. So we're gonna make a shop and start selling all the ribos, the bees and stuff like that. Alright, this should be good, yeah. I'm gonna be selling everything super cheap because by tomorrow there should be clan selling tier 2 weapons for like 500 so for. So I don't think anyone will be buying ribos and DBs by then. After that, I did manage to sneak into a choil twice. And well, this is what I got the first time. This is what I got in the second run. Nothing too crazy happened. Just some groups and a few guys trying to break my boat. What the heck? But yeah, we're going to skip that. I called two airdrops and got a bunch of guns. And a second C4 that will be put into very good use soon. I researched extra ammo and as it was very early into the wipe jet, I went to raid a few small bases. I saw this guy buying a boat, so I'm guessing he should have some stuff. Oh nice, another window. Man, <laughs> this is not looking very promising, but I'm not like I did to use much to be fair. Actually, I don't even need to put a lot. <laughs> no, come on. Oh, okay. Well, that, that's something, I guess. <laughs> At least it wasn't empty. Well, we didn't make a lot of profit in this one, but we are going to hit another base nearby. I think this guy's rage kit or something because they left one door open and forgot to put wood in the TC. Okay. Well, okay, it's not terrible at least. I haven't used anything at all, so whatever they have is profit for me. Come on, like the rates were not bad actually. We use a satchel that I found in a box and like 60 S flow. So yeah, I take it. I went off for a few hours and when I came back, someone failed to raid one of my neighbors and some rats were trying to finish the raid with the bees. What the heck? I actually wanted to raid that base. Oh my god. <laughs> what the heck? Okay, we're coming back. Oh, there he is. I can catch them. Oh, the Ribo guy is helping me out. Oh, no way. <laughs> I think he's dead. The Ribo guy clutch. <laughs> Oh nice, holy shit. That was such a lucky timing to come back by me, dude. <laughs> okay, nice, nice. I need to get this back to base. Oh, wait, let me restock my customer's demand. <laughs> oh, it was selling everything so quick. Nice. I think these guys didn't break the DC because they didn't seal or anything. So I'm gonna come back and try to break it myself. Oh, 
Oh yeah, they didn't break it easy yet. I guess they already looted the best stuff, but there might be something in the as well. Yeah, I guess they already got the best loot, but hey, this is okay as well. Okay, we actually got so much stuff from this fight. Then, I had to go for a few hours, and when I came back, I met my new neighbors. And well, in Rust, that usually doesn't go very well. The heck is going on here? Oh my god, the guy just destroyed me, wow. Oh well, but I have a bug right here. Oh wait, they might live in one of these new bases. I'm gonna try to follow them. I think they actually live in this little base though. Oh my god, I whiffed so hard. Oh yeah, this is the guy that just killed me with Sal. And if only they didn't build so close to my base, but they can actually give me problems in the future. I still have to C4, so I'm gonna come back there to scout them, see how many they are, and well, maybe, maybe we can do something, yeah. This guy probably lives here with a Russian guy that I just killed, because he was just going straight to the base. Oh, yeah, he lives there for sure. Okay, so for now I only have two names. Okay, gonna go back there again. <laughs> He's on a sitting roof all day now, that's so annoying, dude. I hate roof campers, dude. And the problem is that they live super close to my base, so like every time I go out, I'm gonna have them messing around. <laughs> oh my god, this guy, dude. And he's actually hitting a lot of shots. I'm gonna go there with ladders to see their base, and maybe I can go deep or something if he goes to the roof again. Oh, there he is. Actually, I'm going to shoot to try to bait them to go outside. <laughs> he is in the roof again instead of trying to help his teammate. Fuck, I didn't finish this guy and he probably crawled away. Yeah, I don't know where I killed the first guy. I will try to find it after. God. Where did this guy come from, dude?
Oh my god, this guy could have killed me so easily there. The heck? That's almost enough as for ammo to break a seat metal door. Well, he left the door open now, maybe I can see something. Uh, if I had a little bit more of Explo, I could raid this door though. The bunker might be open. Yeah, and they are both in timer now. Well, I can 2C4 the roof. Wait, there's nothing here, right? Yeah, okay. I'm gonna take the 2C4 and come back. I'm gonna craft a TC and a city metal door just to seal and we go. Okay, let's go. Plan is simple. I'm gonna crouch there and instantly to see for the roof where I think they place the TC. I might have to break these boxes though. Oh, this is here, nice. How the heck am I doing? I already have a bedding plan and a hammer. Pick up this box. Oh my god. Holy shit. <laughs> this is so scuffed, dude. <laughs> they can't do anything because I have TC and the boxes are blocking them. I just need to keep the distance with them because the only way I lose this is dying to DB. Hey, never mind, they can't do anything. I just need to seal this. Oh, now I see. They lost all their guns fighting me before. That's why they were not really like fighting back during the raid, though. That's so unfortunate for them. <laughs> did, did I break something? Okay, okay, everything is fine. Mm, okay, 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 nice. It's pretty good, actually. After transferring everything, this is what I got from fighting them and from the raid. It wasn't about the loot, it was more about taking down a potential enemy, but hey, it was pretty worth it as well. Also, as I was stacking out of flags, I spent some time making a few base upgrades. After that, I went around my area to see what was going on and maybe find a new raid target. Oh, he's building camp out right now. Oh my god, no way. Why would you take all the walls at once?
and no one was watching him either. It's gonna be so mad at his teammates right now, dude. <laughs> well, I, I wish I had found this guy from making my own compound. <laughs> but well, I, I take it, yeah. I'm gonna come back, maybe I can get something else from them. They must be so angry, dude. <laughs> I'm gonna shoot to bait them. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> they think I live in this ways. Get me out. <laughs> what, what is this game, dude? <laughs> Fucking nighttime, really? <laughs> I'm gonna wait the night before going out again, dude. What the heck? He has a broken wall. Hey, what is going on here? Ah, he just wanted to break the TC, I guess. Oh, <laughs> that's that's not the ammo that I wanted to use. <laughs> Holy shit, that guy almost destroyed me, dude. I think that's the guy who wanted to break the TC. I'm not gonna finish him. I, w I want him to watch how I take his loot. <laughs> Rusty is such a hardcore game, man. <laughs> really. <laughs> oh my god. Holy shit, I wasn't expecting anything, honestly. Well, that was pretty good, yeah. Holy shit, okay, we're going for that. Yeah, the boys are here. I think this is the best that was getting rated. Maybe they didn't expect the gas store. I don't know, I'm gonna wait around. Oh, what the heck? This guy got AK? What? I thought it was just a random hazmat guy. I'm gonna depot this and come back. I'm going back just with uh, Tommy because fighting in this weather is super random though. You can get shot in the back anytime. Oh, here they are. Nice. What the heck? How did this guy even see me already? Oh, they are probably going to try to raid the crash store now. I'm gonna try to sneak on them. I don't, I don't know how many they are though. Okay, that was really close. The guy crawling told me where I was hiding. What the heck?
Nice, dude. I'm pretty sure they will try to finish the raid again. So yeah, I will be paying attention to that. These guys stopped raiding that base for now. So I was going to large oil. But then something more interesting catch my attention. <laughs> These guys are surrounding me like sucks, dude. Oh, wait, wait. I'm gonna try to flip this guy's boat. Oh, well. <laughs> oh, fuck. No, 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 no. Stop, stop. Stop. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> this is not good. Wait, never mind. This, this is genius. They can't hit me now. What the heck? His teammate is leaving. He's probably loaded. I'm gonna try to find this guy's uh, body, but holy, I can't see anything with this fog. What the heck? Oh my god. <laughs> that was embarrassing by me, dude. Okay, but they live in this base. So his mate that was uh, in the boat might have one in the fishing village and a spawn in the base. So yeah, I, I must be paying attention to that. 80 bullets for a revolver, okay, dude. Dude, I can't find this guy's body. Oh, finally. Oh my god. What the heck are you doing? Holy. I swear I heard someone swimming. Ah, well, never mind, I guess. Okay, I need to get out with this. I can't control the boat because we are way too close to the ground. I hope I don't get shot in the back, dude. Oh my god, dude. He came swimming all the way around. That was so scary. Am I going to greet for his body? Of course. <laughs> okay, nice. I can loot his body now. I can't find it, dude. Okay, they must be in timer now. Oh, found it. Oh my god. It's so loaded, too. What? Fuck it, fuck it. I'm being so greedy. Holy dude. These guys are hardcore, like hardcore, hardcore farmers. And they live in such a small base. So much, man. What the heck? I'm actually thinking that I could try to online raid them. They seem to be just a duo and they won't expect it. Yeah, we're actually going to try to raid them right now. I'm gonna craft a few rockets and go there before they spawn. Like, their base is so small, dude. I'm just gonna take four rockets and some, some explo. I we are ready. I took an extra kit and a bed in case I die because I live really far from them. Nice, they didn't spawn the base. It's a stone roof, right? Yeah, it is. Okay, cool, cool. Campfire is on, but I can't hear them inside the base. They must be roaming or something. Wait, where is the core? Ah, it should be here, okay, okay.
Oh, they're actually not inside, yeah. I don't think they're rich kitted though. I'm gonna watch out. Oh, here they are, what the heck? <laughs> this guy is having more fun now that he got raided than he had the entire wife, dude. <laughs> This guy is literally defending the Wraith only with his voice. Uh -oh. Alright, we should be fine now. What are you guys doing? Blow up this door to have this door. <laughs> Wait, what, what an amazing quote. You have to blow up this door yes, to have this and door. I got all the sulfur, just as you know. <laughs> this guy, yeah, you have all the sulfur in your entrance, right? <laughs> sulfur and the gunpowder is mine. Well, GG, boys. Well done. He didn't realize yet that I'm solo. Oh, okay, he's unlocking the doors. Well, and now I know for sure that he was not hiding loot there. After transferring everything, this is the best loot that I got from the raid. It wasn't much, honestly, but the farm that I got from them before surely made for it. By this time, my shop had made out of profit during the wipe. Good shop, good shop. And despite the raids that I had already done, I still had a lot of sulfur to use. And we were going to put that into very good use soon. Oh, it's the guys, they are reading the base with such a again. Oh, he doesn't have the code. There might be one more inside. Oh well, never mind, we are fine. Ah fuck, but there is no metal in the TC. I'm gonna have to craft wooden door. Alright, let's see what's in here. I'm gonna try to get everything I can and ditch before they come back. Not feeling very safe with the wooden door, honestly. <laughs> well, they have some stuff, I guess. Well, I guess they are back already.
Okay, I think we're good. Actually, that was pretty good. I didn't realize I had that much stuff. After countering the raid, I had an interesting interaction with a new neighbor who was supposed to be a solo player as well. The heck is this base design, dude? What the fuck, man? Please don't kill me. I play him solo. Man. Keep his name in mind. Please. Don't kill me. Oh yeah, he has kills, yeah, yeah. Okay, dude. I play solo. <laughs> oh my god, this guy looks so depressed about playing solo. <laughs> Come on, dude. So is fun, I swear. <laughs> One hour later, I found the same guy. <laughs> this is the solo guy. This guy is actually making me feel bad. <laughs> I'm playing solo as well. I have a kilo, dude. It's your house, man. Oh my god. Wow. This guy seems to be harmless and friendly, right? Well, people say you cannot trust anyone in Rust for a good reason, so keep his name in mind. When I woke up the next day, I went for a roam to try to find a new base to raid. Oh, okay, let's take a look. Meh, landing scap heli inside a compounded base is so idiot. I don't think anyone is going to counter that. Oh, this base is active. Am I going to get roof camped? I don't care about the reboot, dude. Computer is going to explode one day, man, I swear. <laughs> I could actually try to raid these guys, but I don't know, I will think about that because uh, raiding in the forest is so painful. Oh! Okay. Oh my god, I'm getting shot in the back all the time. <laughs> Holy shit, these guys. How many of them are camping right now? <laughs> oh my god, not the best players, I would say. <laughs> oh, that's the uh, guys who were roof camping. Come here, rats. <laughs> oh, the Russian solo guy is online. <laughs> what the heck? He has AK now. <laughs> He's sort of camping with it already. Oh my god, dude. He seemed to be so nice, but you can't trust people in this game, really. <laughs> Look at this, dude. How many times did he ask me to not kill him yesterday? Oh 
Oh, he has friends now. He's not solo anymore, I see. Yeah, of course, dude. Now I can't leave my base without getting roof camped. Dude, what is this? The bow and the DB guy are playing with him because he's not shooting them. Yeah, he upgraded the base and I can hear multiple full steps inside the base. So he's not solo now. I guess they have been grinding all the night because he was naked all the time yesterday and now he has AK. <laughs> Look at this, dude. I'm gonna wait till they come outside and try to fight them. Oh, finally they come out. Oh wait, I think he's solo actually. I don't want to get shot in the back by his mates, but I think he came outside solo now. Oh, yeah, that's, that's his teammates. Well, hopefully that was their only AK, because I don't want to get the roof cam by AK every time I go outside, dude. The heck? This guy's shooting me through that. How can he see me? Oh my god, what is this dude? So instead of fighting me as a trio, two of them are baiting me from far, meanwhile the other one is camping me with DB. Like, that's so lame dude. Look at this dude. They are going all the way around to avoid fighting me as a trio. Like, they are so lame, it's amazing. Sometime after, they did manage to get away with my AK set, and of course, they did it without trying to fight back. You guys remember when I told you you can't trust anyone in this game? Just don't kill me. I'm playing solo. The guy who was begging me the day before to not kill him because he was solo, now he's still camping me with his trio. Look at this guy, dude. Not gonna lie, they were being pretty annoying. So, I went to their base to talk, and after trying to recruit me, you have good aim. Maybe you invite uh, my team, you know? They said they were not going to roof camp anymore. No, 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 yeah, I, I don't roof camp. So, I took a little break, and when I came back, this is the first thing that I saw. I can't believe it. Like, I just came online and they are already roof camping. What the heck, dude, these guys? What? What is this guy doing? Ah, now I see. So there is one in the roof and the other two are looting the dead bodies. Living close to them was just impossible for me. I tried to get the AK back in order to stop them, but I failed. And as you can see, they just kept camping everyone around. I just had to raid them, so I spent the next few hours preparing everything. I did manage to get over a row of rockets, I built a raid base. And once the morning came, I went for it. I think we're fine. Ah, so annoying, I'm gonna have to be building all the time. But I don't want to risk rocketing myself.
Okay, we'll go through the garage doors, I guess. Okay, first loot room. Oh, holy shit. Oh my god, nice, nice. I'm gonna depot this already in the right place, I think. Okay, I just need a few more rockets. I know I could subside the stone wall, but I just want to finish the raid fast and see it before the counters arrive. Okay, one more rocket. Nice, I'm gonna see it fast. Okay, let's see what they have. Holy comps. Okay, okay, not bad. Ah, that's my AK. <laughs> oh, nice. Holy shit, nice, nice. They had a lot of sulfur, actually. Oh, one of them was online all this time. I guess he was AF gaming while I was raiding them. I can't feel bad for them, honestly. After getting door cam and roof cam so hardcore, this is just what they deserve. So yeah, I'm gonna start transferring everything. Oh, there's someone behind the base. And this is how it ends. This was one of my best force wipes ever. If you are watching this, please consider subscribing. I have been making Rust movies for a while and I will keep making more and improving my content. So yeah, if you want to help me out, please subscribe. Hopefully we can make it to 5k subs by the end of this year. Stay safe guys and see you in the next one.